Hello again. Just a couple more days to my vacation. And so, just gonna get this out of the way really quick. Like Legend of Korra episode note 8 review. I hope the next streams meet. Okay, so, what we have, and so, Asami, and Korra, uh, Marco and Bola inform us of a new team avatar. Uh, uh, and uh, how to help counteract like, the threat of the equalists. Yes. And this is an episode where they decided that I really, really don't, don't like. Hey, hey. His name. Hold on. Hold on. Give me a minute. Okay. So, Tarlock is Councilman's name. I mean, I, I knew who the guy was, I just couldn't place his name. Yeah, but, make sure that my hatred of bureaucrats is justified. I mean, what I consider bureaucrats, this is generally what I consider to be an acceptable target. Yeah. 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 And anyway, <coughs> hey, the, hey, Bayfong, Chief Bayfong is replaced. He's. He's because he's incapacitated from the events of the last episode. And really, and, and, and what, that the, and they really make sure that people, and they, and they really, and, I really, sorry. <sighs> Don't know what's with me in this, in this episode, so I just can't seem to find the words. Come on, get it together, get it together. Ah, there I go. No. Anyway, he he takes out the non bidders on suspicion of being equalists. As, as, as he takes away cuts their power, captures them. Um really don't like how they take him now. No. no. I mean that's really that's SS stuff, man. And that's red and it's scare stuff. Not and that's me. They really wanted to make Mike and Brian really want to make a darker series, and it looks like they're succeeding. And so even as Team Avatar tries to help them, then Tarlock captures there's Mako and Bolin, and and Asami, and 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 Korra is not successful in feeding them. That they into a fight, and he discovers there's that there's that Tarlock is a bloodbender. I mean. That was that was some serious stuff. Nothing you mentioned is when Hama was able to do it. Well, no, Tarlock is able to do it without a full moon, 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 and that. It, I mean, that really proved that there's no turning back with him now. No, he he is he he is. I really he he is is definitely a lawful evil and no irredeemable evil as well. So any and he also so captures Korra. Uh, is exiled from the public city. In the end, that's it. That's how they end the episode. So we're gonna have to tune in next time, and to see what finds out. I'm frankly, I'm really excited for what happens happens next. Next. And so I stand for my belief that that Avatar: The Last Airbender was the best thing that ever happened to Nickelodeon. Again, and and Legend of Course is to cement that fact, that it really gets a mind of a movie that will shall not be named. Hint. Hint. Anyway, when we my verdict. Hint. We're gonna give this episode four out of four stars. Yes, and and the next couple of episodes probably when they filmed under my under my dad's new house. House, house in California. Yeah, you know, that's per I'm not really sure what the layout is yet, but uh, trust me when I say hey, I can find in recording space. If not, if say if well, heck if the weather's nice enough, I'll even go outside. It's just it has to see how, how my MacBook responds on the camera box camera responds to natural light. Anyway, that's all I have to say. Leave a comment, subscribe, and I'll see you later.